The question is, how can we clearly separate what our current level of skill is from what we want it to be? What do you know? What do you think? So what do you know is who you are? Like, and I'm gonna give you a tennis example. If, if I'm serving to the deuce court, I know serving in gear one, I know I can make five out of 10. Like that puts no pressure on me at all. Nothing, no pressure, no anxiety, no nervousness. If I miss the first three, I'm still not gonna be worried. If I miss four, I'm not gonna be worried because I'm not going to miss four in a row serving in gear one. I know that. The feeling of certainty, I know it. What do I think? That's ambition. That's what do I want to be? That's how good do I want to be? What do I think I can do is always a little more than what I know. And it creates a little bit of stress. So I know I can make five out of 10 gear one deuce court serves, but I think I can make seven, maybe eight. If I'm serving full speed, I know I can make four. I think I can make six. And we know it inside our body. So what do you know? What do you think? The power of it as awareness tool is that what I think creates stress. What I know is total relaxation. Somewhere between those two things, there's an edge. And if I can get on that edge, I can be fully relaxed, fully engaged under increasing pressure. But first I have to be able to separate these two things. A lot of us just live in what we think. We're not used to what do we know. We have to be honest about what scares us. Like maybe I know one, maybe I get nervous really easily. If I can own that, I can grow. But if I only live in what I think, I can't grow because I'm always under stress. I'm always anxious. I'm always under pressure. So what do you know? What do you think? It's a simple awareness tool. On to the next thing. So change doesn't have to take weeks or months or years. The moment you are able to get a clear picture of what your current level of skill is, you begin to get better every single time you step on the court. I'm really looking forward to hearing from you with any comments or questions as you take Telos Tennis out on the court. And if you want to learn more Telos exercises, just check out my online video courses for players or for coaches at telostennis.com. And of course, remember to hit the like button, ring the notification bell, and subscribe. All right, that's it for now. Take Telos out on the court and enjoy the adventure.